Well, let's start on the hardwood tonight in boys hoops. It was a good one in Spring Valley. The Kingsland Knights hosted the Spring Grove Lions. The Lions came out hot in the first. Take a look at this. Spring Grove moves the ball around the perimeter, finding Jackson Strandman behind the arc. Nothing but that. The Lions lead by 10. Spring Grove's Jacob Olerud has some space. He adds three more to the board. The Lions are up 13 early, and Kingsland finally gets some points on the board, too. Jaden Brink drains the triple. Spring Grove handed the Knights their first loss, getting the 60-40 to victory. Here are some North Iowa boys basketball finals. The Lake Mills Bulldogs knocked off the Bishop Garrigan Golden Bears 78-59. And the Newman Catholic Knights beat the Nashua Plainfield Huskies 74-63. In girls hoops, it was a crosstown matchup tonight at John Marshall. The Rockets hosted the Mayo Spartans. JM is up by double digits with just under 10 minutes to go in the first. Rockets Jasmine Dang gets the steal and she finishes with the layup at the other end. Mayo is up by seven, and the Spartans find Amelia Mills on the way to the hoop. She adds two to the board. Mayo extends its lead to ten. Spartans' Madeline McLaughlin gets the tip. Mayo pushes the ball up the court. Mills with another layup. The Spartans come away with the win. Mills led the team in points, scoring 15. In North Iowa girls basketball, the Osage Green Devils knocked off the St. Ansgar Saints 48-42, and the West Hancock Eagles won in a close one over the Garner Hayfield Ventura Cardinals 51-47. And switching to the ice in boys high school hockey, the Austin Packers beat the Worthington Trojans 4-1. The Dodge County Wildcats shut out the South St. Paul Packers 9-0. On the girls' side, the Albert Lee Tigers won in a close one over the Laverne Cardinals 2-1. The Northfield Raiders are still undefeated, shutting out the Mayo Spartans 6 to nothing. 